Welcome everybody to How to Pass the Math FSA, fourth grade edition. We've got um, our standard today is maths.4.mbt.1.2 and we're on lesson eight, which is read, write, and compare whole numbers. So let's see, 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 let's plus 2 times 10 as a number. I'm going to show my work over here because that's my equation editor and then I'll write my finalized answer into the box. Nothing but my answer goes into the box. Keep your work to the side. Alright, so we got 5 times 100,000. Well, what is 5 times 100,000? That would be... Here I can see that we're starting in the hundred thousands place. So I'm going to make digits. So 1 tens, hundreds, comma, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands. And it says it's five is in the one hundred thousands place. Well, the one hundred thousands place is right here. Five. Okay. Four times one thousand. So where is the thousands place? Ones, tens, hundreds, comma, thousands. Four. Okay, and then 2 times 10. 2 times 10, so that would be in the tens place. 1's, 10's, I'd put a 2. And that's not my answer, folks. I still have spaces here, and although they do not have a number, they still have to be accounted for for a value. So in order to do that, we need to place the number 0 in there. So my finalized answer would be 504,020. Okay, we're on example two. It says which phrase represents 62,588? Okay, and it's written in word form. It's a multiple choice answer, so there's only one correct answer. Um, it might be more than one, but we know, if I'm letting you know for this one, it's only going to be one answer. I'm going to let you know something right here. I know a lot of smarty pants students out there who always blow it when it comes to these because they read too quickly, okay? Some kids who are pretty good at who are really good at math, they tend to go too fast and they don't think about what they're doing. Very easy problem right here, but you need to think, you need to stop, slow down and read it carefully. So, let's look at it. All right, so we need 62,588 so I'm going to take each one and write the standard form of that answer over here. So this says 62,588. That's not even a number. 62,62 what? 60, it doesn't say 62,000, 60, it doesn't tell us. So I'm going to actually going to automatically eliminate that one. B, 62,000. 588. Some kids would pick this because they see the 6 and the 2 and they're reading too quickly and they're reading 62, but it only says 6, 2. That is wrong. 62,580. That's close, but they left off this 8 right here. That one's wrong, so it must be D, so I'll pick it, right? No. No. You got to read the whole thing. 62,588. Let me check. 62,588. 62,588. That is my answer. Question mark. Circle it. Yes. Okay, let's do example three. But before we do example three, I know this is kind of hard to see. It's a little bit hard, but you might want this right in front of you. And you might be saying, Miss McCarthy, how can I get this resource right in front of me on paper so I can see it? Uh, click the, descri the description box below, and I have a link that'll take you to the same resource that I'm using. But it's not just that one. It's the entire fourth grade, I'm sorry, the entire fourth grade level um, complete guide. It's right there for you. Take a look at it, and it comes with hundreds of more problems. So do that. So let's take a look. Select all options with 32,829 written in expanded form. It says select all. So this is a multi-select 
problem, that means there's probably going to be more than one correct answer. So I'm going to go through each one carefully. But first, I want to point something out right here. It says expanded form. And you're probably used to expanded form being like this. Plus da 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 da. Okay? And it sort of is, but this is actually the, it's, it's a version of expanded form that you might not have seen before. So make sure you're paying attention. 32,829. Okay. Um, before we start, we're going to need to know a little bit of stuff. So this is the ones place. The two is in the tens place. The eight is in the hundreds place. The two is in the thousands place. And the three is in the ten thousands place. I'll write it like that. Okay, thousands and the ten thousands place. So, A says three ten thousands, twenty eight hundreds, and twenty nine ones. Now you might not have seen it like this before, so listen carefully. Let's start with three ten thousands. We have three in the ten thousands place. That's correct. Let me check that part. Twenty eight hundreds, twenty eight whoop, hundreds. So that is correct. 29 ones. And you might be thinking there's only nine ones. That's true, but technically there are also, because there's two tens, stands for 20, so 29 boop, ones. So that one is right. So this is a correct answer. Three ten thousands. We already did that. Two thousands. Two thousands. Eighty two hundreds. Eighty two tens. Eh, that makes this one wrong. Okay, let's look at C. It says thirty thousands. Well, this says thirty two thousands, but I'm going to try something real quick. So it technically is, this is the thirty thousands place. So let's write thirty thousand twenty hundreds, so twenty zero zero, eighty tens, eighty in the tens place, twenty nine ones, twenty nine. If we add that up, nine, two, eight, two, three, thirty two thousand eight hundred twenty nine. So that would be a correct answer. It's kind of tricky, so you may need to rewind that and see what I did. All right. Okay, let's look at D. 30,000. I'm going to write this out in words. 30 thousands. 28 hundreds. 28 hundreds. 20 tens and nine ones. So if I add that up, I get nine, zero, ten, boop. I'm already seeing that this is wrong. So no, that is not right when I add it up like that. Okay. 32, I'm on D now. I'm sorry, E. 32 thousands, yes. Eight hundreds, yes. Two tens, yes. Nine ones, yes. And finally, F. Three ten thousands, yes. Two thousands, yes. Eight hundreds, eight hundreds, yes. Two tens, two tens, yes. Nine ones, nine ones, yes. So our correct answers here are A, C, and D. Oh, I forgot to pick E too. It's a good thing I went back to check. Right, D as well, because I marked them all right. Boop, 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 boop. Woo, that one was a doozy. Ooh.